Oh. See, that's that spooky ghosty shit. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, or welcome to my YouTube channel if you're new here. My name is Dead by Pony. Today we're hopping into Dead of Night. I know it came out a while ago. When I originally tried to play it, I was too scared. So I had to come back to it when I was a little more ready for that and playing all the FNAFs and things. Poppy playtime. I feel like I finally get a place where I could handle it. And I, I can. So I wouldn't to hold us up any further. Without further ado, let's hop in. All right, here we go. Oh no. I love me a spooky ghost story. Hello? Hannah, where are you? You all went off and left me behind. Where are you now? What's this number? We've all booked into a hotel on the road. How far away are you? I don't know. I'll have to call when I get there. You can't. There's no signal. Well, it doesn't matter. Just go to bed, Hannah. Well, listen. Make sure you're... Ooh, already building that tension. Sea View Hotel. Ah, Maya, I presume. Uh, oh, don't be alarmed. Uh, your friends booked you in. Uh, let me just check. Ah, yes. Uh, room 101. It's all been paid for, so you don't have to worry about anything. You are very nice friends. Very nice. And there's uh, quite a few of you I see as well. Nice to see so many fresh, young faces <laughs> for a change. Uh, you're here for the music festival in town, I presume? Yeah, we were supposed to be camping there tonight, but... <laughs> there's hardly weather for that, is there? <laughs> uh, will you be staying for breakfast? I don't think so. We'll probably just get going. That's fine. And uh, if you don't mind me asking, Maya, would you be interested in uh, the entertainment tonight? Tonight? Uh, starts around midnight, usually. It's, it's me doing it, actually. Comedy. I do this comedy character called uh, Hugo Punch. He's sort of this comedic sociopath, says things that you're not supposed to say, and that sort of thing. It's quite popular with students. I don't think so. We're all just going to bed, I think. Are you sure I can't twist your arm on this? It's okay, I'd rather just go to bed. Sorry. Fine, fine, fine. fine. Which way are the rooms? Um, just take the lift, uh, you're on the first floor. Okay, thanks. Oh, and, and then drop your key off in the box, uh, if you will, Maya, please, tomorrow. There we go. Ugh. Best show in town and no takers. Who needs proper entertainment when you've got YouTube and my face or whatever? Stupid, uncultured. You don't like rude children. They're naughty. Don't start this again. Ooh. I don't want to hear it, okay? Not tonight! Naughty children are bad eggs. They need to be taught a lesson. Uh-oh. Shut up! Just shut up! 
You always do this. They're paying customers. They haven't done anything to you. Just leave them alone. Bad eggs need cracking. Whack them hard and crack the shell. Kick them down the stairs to hell. You know what you need to do, Jimmy. Show them who's boss. That's the way to do it. <laughs> Nope. Don't love. Gonna try. Nope. No fun for you. Ooh, a master key. See, this is your call to action. See, View Hotel has a dark past. Its ghosts have a story to tell. Use the ghost and spirit receiver to talk to them. They'll tell you Jimmy's secrets. But Jimmy must hide the truth. At all costs. This is a device uh, found selection. This device you found, select this to switch it on. You need to find you need to find a compass drawing mirror. If you haven't seen it, go to the menu and watch the tutorial video before you continue. Fun. You have no items to see yet. Cool. If you spirit, you can ask them questions. Pair their replies to make connections when you're alone. Can you review the spirit's replies here? This loud noise means there's a spirit in high energy state. Nope. Nope. Okay. Nothing in there. What that door? New. No. All right. Call the lift. First floor. Tell this is not an American game because first floor would have been the one we're on. We don't do ground. Find a compass and a scrying mirror. Yes. I just realized it might be helpful if I could hear things. Because I remember you can hear Jimmy talking. You now I can hear him in the headphones with the direction in one ear or the other.
Look around. Search. Okay. It's only one side. Yes, reveal hints and clues when used in dark places. You can only use it when this icon is visible. Either by the door in the rooms or in the ground floor kitchen. Use the mirror to see clues about where to go or which items to use next. It will also help you locate lost keys, compasses, and ghost spots. It was so loud. I surrendered a bottle of diazepam medicine. Found the room to 105. So it went well. Cool. What do we have in 112? The deadlock key for 112. And a bottle of turmentine and a lighter. Right. 20, 119. Perfect. Compass. Points towards nearby spirits. All right, so now what does the mirror say? A little girl crying. LG. much better with horror games than I used to. Last time I tried to play this, I I didn't even get this far. I was horrified. In here. In here. No. Let's try 
try. You meet a spirit, you can speak to them questions. Spare their replies. To make questions when you're alone, you can review the spirit's replies here. You contact the spirit. Alright. Can't figure out how to do this, so I'm gonna try going back. You go to the ground floor. See, that's that spooky ghosty shit. Nope, we're gonna go back down. Apparently she didn't want to talk quite yet. Try now. Is someone there? Hello? Oh. What's your name? about the things you've seen. You'll see their reply when selecting them. I saw a girl in the basement crying. Who was she? Jeff's hat belong to? I don't know. Where did the bottle of diazepam come from? I don't know. Uh. I found a bottle of turpentine in a lighter. What were they for? I didn't know what they were until Jimmy showed me. Oh. I feel like we got some more exploring to do on the first floor then. All the secrets, huh? Still no Jimmy. Nope, nothing. All right. Does it help that I'm not writing down what rooms I'm going into? Let's cry. Little girl. I 
points of 102. I hope you enjoyed today's video, and if you did, hit like. That way, I know you're enjoying the content I'm making. You hit subscribe. That way, YouTube brings you back here to see what happens next, and I won't take up any more of your time. Have a good day. I'll see you all next time. Bye bye.